To understand how to use the Peak Day app fully, let's talk a little bit about female cycles and fertilization. What is fertility awareness? What are the different phases in your cycle? What happens to your body in each of these phases? What happens to your body if fertilization or pregnancy take place? These are all questions we will answer in this video. Fertility awareness is a type of bodily knowledge centered on recognizing the phases of a woman's fertility cycle, where she learns to recognize external, observable signs that reflect the internal hormonal shifts that drive her fertility cycle each month. Two important fertility signs women learn to track are cervical fluid and basal body temperature. Now, let's talk about your cycle. The fertility cycle is far more than the monthly menstrual bleed. It is a wonderful process driven by hormones released from the brain and the ovaries that work together to create times in each cycle when you are infertile and a time when you are fertile. A woman's fertility cycle can be divided into three phases. Phase one of each cycle is an infertile phase that includes menstruation and a few days immediately following it. Phase two is the fertile time when new life can be conceived. It includes the days before ovulation, ovulation, and a few days after. Phase three is the second, longer infertile time beginning after ovulation and continuing until the end of the cycle. How does the cycle work? At the start of the cycle during the menstrual bleed, the follicle-stimulating hormone, FSH, is released from the brain and stimulates follicles, or egg containers, to start to mature in the ovary. Did you know that a woman is born with all the eggs she will have? And after puberty, FSH triggers a few of them to start to grow and mature with each cycle. As these follicles grow and mature, they produce estrogen. As estrogen levels build, a woman can recognize this externally by observing the appearance of cervical fluid. As estrogen levels increase further, the cervical fluid changes in ways that can be easily recognized. Inside, the estrogen is stimulating the lining of the uterus, the endometrium, to grow. A high level of estrogen signals another hormone to be released from the brain, luteinizing hormone, or LH. LH causes one of the mature follicles to rupture and release the egg or ovum. After a woman ovulates, the hormone progesterone builds and drives the progression of her fertility cycle. Now, let's talk about fertilization. What happens in your cycle when an egg is fertilized and what happens when it is not? Should conception take place this cycle, the newly formed life begins with the joining of a sperm from the male and the ovum from the woman in the fallopian tube. The new life immediately begins to grow as it travels down the fallopian tube to the uterus, where it will implant in the endometrium and grow. During this time, progesterone maintains and matures the endometrium for about two weeks in a healthy, fertile woman. This provides time for the fertilized egg to travel down the fallopian tube and implant in the endometrium, and then to send a signal to the mother saying, I'm here now, don't cycle again until I'm born. If the egg is not fertilized, it will disintegrate within 24 hours. If a fertilized egg does not implant in the endometrium, progesterone levels decline after about two weeks. This results in the endometrium shedding, which you recognize as menstrual flow and the whole cycle starts again. So, why is it important to understand your cycle and fertilization to use the Peak Day app? First, you need to understand the different phases of your cycle to interpret your Peak Day charts. The colors on the Peak Day calendar indicate which phase of the cycle you are in. Phase one, yellow. Phase two, green. And phase three, purple. Pink indicates menstrual flow. Dark green indicates your peak day of mucus. Second, understanding how fertilization works is crucial to achieve or avoid pregnancy, which is one of the main ways to use the Peak Day app. Take a look at the other videos about mucus, temperature, and how to chart using Peak Day. Remember, Peak Day is your partner for a happier, healthier, smarter fertility.